Hello guys, my name is JP Dan, and today I will show you how to create a C Sharp WinForm application that can do open file dialog. I will show you how to create an open file dialog in C Sharp WinForm application. So create new project here. Choose WinForm app if it doesn't appear on your recent project templates because you never select it. Windows form app.net search it and find it open file dialog there we go name your form there we go here stretch type character map on your window search bar if you don't if you use the older version of windows like windows xp just search it up on your program exact accessory or just hit run here i will show you how on just press your windows button and your R button to make run window appear and type char map if you use windows xp or even older than that click ok and then scroll down until this section appears choose this block right here copy it paste it to your button there we go there we go now we have a happy little button well I'm imitating Bob Ross there we go now double click your button and this is the code right here now as you can see here open file dialog doesn't exist yet so you actually need to add extra component for your project open file dialog this is it hmm still catching error huh I just don't get it okay guys so I already fixed the bug it turns out there is some kind of a parts that make the bug so yeah in previously we see the open file dialog right here guess what what I want you to do I want you to delete that very quickly and or just create a new project if it if the bug still happens on you so yeah let me just get rid of this very quickly here we go double click it now as you can see here this is the whole code just type it okay this is text box one let's rename it to pat I mean just name oh for fuck's sake what is it now
name there we go name dot text equals OFD dot file name now as you can see here there we go we already finish our project here and I have been recording for the five minutes now it's going to get six minutes too so so yeah here let me just test a vi a test with a file here a picture and it show the full path which mean it worked so as you can see here <coughs> copy and paste the text box again mm -hmm. this time we are going to make it extra snappy okay we name it to pat or just name dot text equals OFD dot save file name and once we test this out oh my god it pisses me off And there we go here we can also get the file name without the distraction of the directory file but if you just wanted to get the full name full path then you can use file name here you can use the file name here if you just wanted to see the name of your file of your selected file then you can use say file name instead of file name okay that is basically pretty much it guys if this tutorial really helpful to you like it really helps you then i hope so if it does then be sure to give a like subscribe comment and share this video to your social media account so that it will help a lot it will help others by sp spreading this video Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video. Goodbye. Almost 10 minutes.